Calculate the number of nitrogen atoms in a 125 gram sample of hydrazine. The chemical formula is N2H4. So to solve this problem, we will just use a series of dimensional analysis conversions. So we start with the given, of course, that is 125.0 grams of N2H4. The first thing you need to do is to convert grams of N2H4 into moles of N2H4. Okay, so what do we need to convert grams into moles? We need the molar mass of N2H4. So one mole of N2H4 if you look at your periodic table and solve for the molar mass of hydrazine, that's 32.052, around this number, grams of N2H4. So, as you can see, the grams of N2H4 will cancel out. Now you have the moles of N2H4. So the first step is done. Next step, you want to convert the moles of N2H4 to the moles of nitrogen because the problem is asking specifically for nitrogen. So how do we do this? You simply look at the chemical formula of hydrazine, which is N2H4. So for every one mole of N2H4, there are two nitrogens. Okay, so for every one mole of N2H4, there are two moles of nitrogen because N2H4. Okay, so... The moles of N2H4 will cancel out. Now you have the moles of nitrogen. And then finally, we can now convert the moles of nitrogen into atoms of nitrogen. So how do we do that? We will use the Avogadro's number. So for every one mole of nitrogen, there are 6.022 times 10 to the 23rd power atoms. So the moles will cancel out, and this will give you the atoms of nitrogen. So let's just summarize our calculation. So you first multiply all the numbers on top. So we have 125.0 times 1 times 2 times 6.022 times 10 to the 23 atoms of nitrogen divided by, in the denominator, we have 32.052 times 1 times 1. Okay. So, if you solve this, in your calculator, you will get approximately 4.697 times 10 raised to the 24th power atoms of nitrogen. And this is the answer to the question.